Hey fellow vault dwellers, it's Angry Turtle and I'm back from my holiday, from my vacation. So there is a lot happening in Fallout 76 that we need to cover, hopefully. I'm on time and you didn't learn all the plans from Mathman Equinox just yet, but even if you did, there, there is still a hope. Now, yeah, there are some bugs, there are some good news, some bad news. What you can see on the screen right now, it's Pet Lizard Terrarium. That's a cool new item for Fallout First for this month. I'm really happy that this month we are getting something really good. So this Pet, pet Lizard Terrarium, awesome. I'm waiting now for Pet Turtle Terrarium. I'm pretty sure it's gone. I just don't know when. I need my pet turtle for my turtle camp. And now, to the point. Okay, news. One by one, and what do you need to know? So first, good news about Mothman Equinox. There is plenty of new rewards that is nicely shared by Sugar Bombs Rats in the post on Extra. I'll show you that. Those are the new rewards that have this marker new. Some of them really cool. I like those teddies. I like those studies. We have some skins for a chainsaw and some other stuff. Even Muffman Bug Zapper is here. It's cool stuff. Cool stuff. A lot of stuff that was available, of course, is still available. On this post, you just have a new stuff. The old stuff will still drop. So Bethesda keep their promise and they did add more event rewards most likely for every event we just hit the first one dropping right now with those rewards but there is as well a bad news and the bad news about that is the second part if you learn the plan it will not drop again so if you if you will okay other words if you roll a duplicate of the plan you already learned you get nothing instead of getting the plan and being able to trade it. So don't learn plans until event will be over. But if you already learned them, we have official message from Bethesda. In here, there's officer message. We have an update on the bug affecting reward drops for the Muffman Equinox event. Thank you to everyone who has taken the time to report this issue so far. The team has a tentative hotfix planned for April 8th that will allow players to receive duplicate plans. We know that you may miss out on rewards during this first week, so we are looking to extend the event beyond April 16th. As our plans solidify and we have more to share, we'll keep you updated. Thanks you for your patience and support. So that is a good news. The bug is being fixed. Now back to the bad news. Some Changes in latest patch did not made its way to the patch notes and they are disclosed now and added to initial patch notes. They are now in the patch notes. They were not there before. So that's the message. We wanted to update you on a few changes that were made in the America's Playground patch that were not initially noted in the patch notes. This includes changes to camp items that have had their budget volume, value modified to be aligned with other items in the same category. The reason why some of you have noticed your camp budget have changed. Also, there was a fix to a bug that was granting experience from kills twice for people who were in a team. So they claim it was a bug. I was thinking it was a feature. Now we know it was not. So the bonus experience for tagging on a team have been removed. I noticed that already on the first live stream when the patch dropped and the adjustment, they call it nicely, but that's a nerf. Basically listed a whole list of camp items have now increased budget requirements. So that's a nerf. That's bad. Uh, good news is they're working to improve the patch note process in the future. What I would like if those patch notes could drop early as soon as the you know maintenance starts as we have plenty of time to read and last patch we got the patch notes in the time that servers went up so whole down time there was nothing to do everyone was waiting when we could check the patch notes do you agree i mean that's what i was doing in the past that i like the system i hope we'll return to it there's no reason, at least I don't know about any reason, to hold off the patch notes until the game is live. 
Do you know about any reason? If you do, let me know. Maybe there is one I'm just not seeing. Now, camp budget changes. We made a change to a small list of camp items that impacted their final value. Items in this list has been incorrectly priced to have a lower budget cost than other items in the same category. The change in the America's Playground patch made items in these categories all share a similar value. Players who had these items in already built camps will find that the overall budget of their camp went up. The following is the list of the items whose value was changed. What they do not specify here, it can result in your camp budget going above 100%. What means when you remove item, you cannot add anything still until you get under 100% of the budget. So a bunch of stairs, increase in price, hedge gate, dying hedge gate, winding path, roof, flat and standard, another stairs, wind chimes, Tunnel of Love Art, Just Married Swan Card, Tunnel of Love Heart Art, more stairs. So mainly stairs, like a lot of stairs, almost like half of this list is stairs. Next, fix a bug that was granting members of a team experience they already stated. And lastly, improvements to water shaders. I still need to look at this water. I don't know what exactly changed. Uh, I plan to observe water a little bit more. What kind of improvement? Did you notice anything improved about the water? Or did it? Let me know if you did notice. So my pet lizard can go home. I like the tap on glass uh, thing that they added. That's, that's new. Like every tap is skipping to the next phase of animation. So that's cool. Like if you wanted to do something else, you skip by tapping on the glass. It's handy to get your lizard to do what you want. So that's cool. As well as you can notice, I already have one plan and I'm not learning. So I'm dropping plans from new event. I just started and I'm not learning them. So don't learn those plans. Even if you learn some already, Stop learning them now until April 8th when they implement a hotfix. Just don't learn any. Just keep collecting them. Don't learn them. And everything will be fine. And of course, I will be with more videos and we'll have a turtle cast tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. I hope this little update is helpful for you. If you have any questions, I'm here now. I'm back. And thank you for being here with me. And see you in the next one.